so with obviously with the ever increasing price of fuel I've been looking at different options of outboards and auxiliary outboards and I came across this and I thought what a great idea look so you've got one clamp here to go on the transom and then basically you screw it on and away you go on the board place it on the transom like that tighten it up so one turn of that you can see how it's turning that there's also a screw here which you can undo and loosen to make it easier I think I'm going to put some tension on that it's quite hard to steer <laughs> and turn the handle Well, if you're just going in a straight line, not too bad. We are moving. Yeah, it's not the easiest thing to try and turn. So yeah, the three-wheeler, it's quite a good little uh, hand-powered outboard. Especially on for like canals and stuff. Oh, running into the bridge here. Yeah. this turn now for using the freewheeler, freewheeling, hand operated outboard. So, being the boat connoisseur you are, sir, what do you think? It's not that bad. If you've got any questions about the freewheeling, hand powered outboard, this thing. Drop a message below, I can try and answer the answer them for you and uh, let you know what I think. Thanks very much for watching my video. If you haven't, press that subscribe button. Get it pressed, press it.